Greetings to everyone out there and welcome back to Around the Clock. It's official. The Super Mario Brothers movie is well, just rotten. And I don't mean that to say that this movie is bad or anything, but according to RottenTomatoes.com, this movie has received such a low score on their website that something incredible has happened. As reported by ComicBook.com, the Super Mario Brothers movie has dethroned 2019's The Lion King as the highest grossing movie domestically to have a rotten score on Rotten Tomatoes. The animated blockbuster from Universal's Illumination and Nintendo added a reported $9.80 million to its haul at the domestic box office over the weekend, grossing an estimated $549.29 million in US and Canada ticket sales despite earning a 59% rotten from critics on the tomato meter. Mario has now surpassed Disney's photorealistic Lion King remake that has a rotten score of 52% to become the 14th highest grossing film domestically and the highest grossing film to be rated rotten on the review aggregator. Now this is pretty interesting and big at the same time because it looks like the critics plan has backfired. This movie is so bad that it's good. And just in case you didn't know, now the Super Mario Brothers movie is the third highest grossing animated movie of all time, surpassing The Incredibles, and the only two standing in its way of being number one is Frozen 1 and Frozen 2. Hopefully it can get that number one spot. With that being said, that's going to do it for this video, and please, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe, and as always, remember to keep it locked here at Around the Clock, where here, we focus on Nintendo news content, Around the Clock. I'll catch you guys in the next video.